Hi and hello, Let's Play fans, it's your pal Berg787, back with a brand new episode of Darkest Dungeon. So, last and uh, last episode we beat the Necromancer Lord, woohoo -hoo. On the next episode after this, we are going to go and fight the Gibbering Prophet and smash him. But in between, we need some heroes to level up, to, to, to rest up and all that jazz, like Raincourt and all that. So, what we're actually going to do, well actually he's not going to be going on it because he's getting stress relief. Then we're having to remove something from him as well, so there's actually going to be Cormelius who's coming next time. But for this episode... What we're going to do is, because we are going to have to go and fight some harder people in here. Oh, look at that. What's this? Could go and fight the Hag Witch. Well, we're not going to because we don't have enough level 5 guys who I'd want to take on that mission. But we do need level 5 guys other than the ones that we've got. So that's what we're going to do in this specific mission. We're going to go and uh, gather some grain sacks. Eh? How about that? And the team that I'm going to take along with me is Dunsk. Then we're going to have Bassett. We're going to have Mallory. And we're going to take one level 5 person with us anyway. Is that worth it? Yeah, why not? I mean, there's no there's no harm in taking... Well, there is a harm in taking her. She could die. Oh, no, she won't actually go on that mission, so... Duh, I completely forgot about that. So we're going to have to remove what I've equipped it for her. There we go. Remove, remove. Does that mean Belcott's coming instead? I suppose it does mean that Belcott's going to come instead. Well, that's fine. We'll level her up. Uh, now, if only I can remember what I gave her. I think it was that and... Ah, oh, that was it. And it was the Shimmering Cloak. I kind of decided to go with a... Alright, you lose a bit of health points. Yeah, I understand that. But you are getting a plus four to dodge, more criticals, uh, and more accuracy. So, all in all, quite a good thing. Uh, but we'll come back to that in a second. Because, actually, I need to go and just upgrade Belcott as well now that, now that this is going to be the case. So we'll put you in here. Oh no, you can't. You are fully upgraded, are you? Oh, Alright, okay. Well, that's pretty good. Is that the same in the guild? It is indeed. Alright, well. It is what it is. We'll come back in. So, Belcott. Mallory. Sorry, I'm having to go through this again. Bassett. And... Dunsk. Cool. The Killers! Mr. Brightside. Okay, so we've already discussed what I've just given her. There... Uh, not Ditton. Dunsk is taking the legendary base braces. So plus 20 damage, percent damage, plus 5 critical, minus 8 on accuracy. But I'm kind of combating that a bit by giving him the plus 10 on range skill, or a little bit less on a critical there. But overall, it should do him fairly well. I like the plus 20 damage full stop. Yes, his actual regular uh, melee attacks are going to be a little bit less accurate, but when they hit, ba boom. Plus, we've also got quite a few decent long range attacks as well. So let's. I take that. I just thought I'd try it because I feel fairly confident that I'm going to do this dungeon. For Mallory, uh, we're using the bounty hunt, uh, the wounding helmet, so more damage, but more chance to be uh, less, less of his move skill. So his um, uh, come hither is not going to be as effective, but that's fine because what we'll do, uh, we've got the speed stone there to give us more speed, but you know, a little bit knock on the critical, but that's fine. And finally, we have Mr. Bassett. If I could click on him, no, I have to click on him here, do I? All right, so speed because we want him to go early so he can mark or heal or whatever he needs to do. And there, so he is losing some accuracy there, minus four accuracy. But we're going to give him plus 10 to ranged accuracy because all his attacks are ranged anyway. So that's good. He does lose a little bit of a critical on it, but that's not the end of the world. He will be going quicker and he will be hitting more often. So fantastic. Let's head out. So where are we going again? We're going to the Warrens, aren't we? Okay, so it's a medium dungeon as well. I don't think I need to buy that much food for it. I think eight. We'll probably pick some up along the way. Because it is the Warrens. There's usually um, some sort of food lying around. But to counter that food... And remember, I'm not really fussed about uh, spending money on shit anymore. Because I'm making so much money. I've got really nothing to upgrade or build. So really, I'm just taking stuff that's going to kind of help me in missions. And whatever else I can carry along the way. I'm still not taking keys though. Because there's just no point. I'll take some holy water as well. And we'll take eight torches. But again, I don't care about the space in my inventory. There's nothing really I want. I'll pick up some trinkets along the way. You know, if there's anything good, that's cool. But everything else, who cares? All right, let's embark. All right. Even the fiercest beast will lay down when it is not eaten. Steal their food. Hmm. It's going to be a little bit annoying, so I probably will have to backtrack a bit. 
because we need to find free grain sacks. So if I go like this and come back and go up, oh, that's going to be fucking annoying anyway. What about if I go like this? Nah, I know what I'm going to do. So if I go boom, 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 boom. So it's going to be less backtracking, I think, going like that. Looks a bit confusing, but trust me, I think I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I think. All right, let's move on. Mm, what does this do again? Holy water. All right, okay. Well, that wasn't good. Minus 20 dodge. Won't last with us forever, but at least I know for future reference, don't touch that with holy water. Holy water seems to work on a lot of things. Not on that, though. Maybe I should have got him to have a look. All right, we'll take the torch. We'll use it straight away. Wonderful. Let's keep moving. Bomb, 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 bomb. Into the next room. Anyone? Does anyone want to fight us? No? Okay. I suppose we'll keep on moving. We do have a fight coming up, so there is that. This. I feel that's correct. No? All right. Let's try them. Let's try it. This is all experimenting. No, that didn't do anything. All right. Well, then fuck it. Let's just leave that alone then. Don't want to touch rusty blood. Oh, no. You know what? It, maybe it was bandages. Let's try that one more time. Is it bandages? It is bandages. All right. And that got us a ton of food. I knew we didn't need to buy more food. Ah, so bandages for that shit. I wish I hadn't wasted all my other goods, but yeah, we know for future reference. Cool. Um, all right. Why are you going first before him? Why, wow, your speed's 11. How comes? What is this quirk that's giving you? Ah, quick draw. Uh, yeah. Actually, that's kind of annoying because I want him to go before him so he can mark people, but all right, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Uh, who are you going to kill for me? That's the interesting question. Uh, Alright, hit him. You're not going to kill him, though, are you? Because you're an arsewipe. Alright, okay. Now you're going to get vomited on? Well, no, you're not, because you dodged it. Good stuff. Munch. Oh, and another miss. Or dodge, I suppose. I should give my people credit for that. They dodged it rather than they missed. Uh, what are we going to do now? Hmm. Hmm. You know what I'm going to do? I know what I'm going to do. I'm put a curse on you, my friend. Just in case we don't kill you, you're going to be uh, not as hitting... You, you might miss with your vomit again, which is kind of the point. Grape shot blast. Bam, bam, bam. Everyone taking some beats. Almost dead. Could do a breakthrough here. Does debuff me, but we'll probably won't have another fight before that wears off. Seems a little bit pointless, to be honest, so let's just hit them normally. Uh, you, take that. Come on. We're going to get another go before he goes? Yeah, fantastic. All right, so let's finish that off. And move on. Another key, another food. Wonderful. Almost out of room already. Yeah, yeah, shut up, man. All right, into the next room. No one here. And still no sacks of grain either. Wonderful. Where are these sacks of grain? Where art thou? All right, a bunch of maggots. This oh, come on, lads. Don't get surprised by maggots. You've seen them a hundred times before. Uh, what to do here? Well, I suppose weakening curse. That's all you can really do. Actually, I should have moved you back, really. It's a bit silly keeping you there. Um, he resisted the weakening curse, but we can still hit him and kill him. There we go. So that's one down, at least, out of them. Uh, grave nibble. Nah, another miss for you. All right, you can't keep missing, though. All right, yeah, I was going to say, the... the, the the baddies had to hit us sooner or later. But good resist. Okay. Uh, grape shot blast a lot of them. Should. Pretty good chance to kill all three. Wow. I only killed one. That's really disappointing. They did minimum damage on two of them. Doing like 6 to 15 and we only needed to do 8 to kill. So it's a little bit disappointing that we... Well, maybe not killed all, but we could have at least killed two. Eh? Um, You just do your little powering up. Ah, Goku. There we go. Buff, buff, buff. Uh, finish him off. See you later. Can we get a quick go before he does? It'd be nice. Now you fucking maggot. Oh, at least it wasn't nothing bad though. A little bit of stress. It's okay. Alright, we're good to go. Take that. Let's head out. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Alright. Just gonna swap all this around now. 
There we go, that's back to normal. And why don't we um you know why don't we do a bit of that? So I don't want to touch that basically. We'll leave that well alone after what happened last time. Where are we at here? No one? Alright, we do get a bit of a scout on though. Okay, we've got a fight on our hands. Uh, well, we've got two fights from quick, pretty short succession here. Right at the end of this corridor, and then one more in the next room. Some heirlooms. Uh, we'll take them, but we'll start to be discarding them pretty soon. Oh, right, okay. Interesting. Kind of annoying that you're right at the back there, I'm not going to lie. Let's just try and get rid of these bitches first. Nine damage again, man. You can kill them, you know. You don't have to just tickle them. Uh, I think it would be a good idea to get an early mark down on you, so we're ready. We're ready for Mallory to uh, start bashing. Ah, you toothy penis. Fuck off. Alright, four damage. That's alright. That's nothing. That's tickling back. Oh, right. Okay, blight. That's, that's something. Howl. Easy. Easy. Calm down. You don't need to howl. Alright, grape shot blast. Good. Kind of hoping that you'd kill both, but at least we've got rid of one, which means Mallory will be able to hit with finish him move, because he wouldn't have been able to hit. You can only hit the front two with that move that counts on the marked. So we're in a good spot there. You bleed the ghoul as well, hopefully. Damage, bleed, yeah, how much we do? Three, okay. So that's what it is, I guess, for level four people. And now collect bounty, sorry, not not finish him. Finish him the one is when they're stunned, but we'll collect bounty. 25's not bad at all. Okay, you're not in a good way. Uh, what do we want to do? Let's get a heal on here. There we go, 30. Actually, I should have used the, I should have used the medicine on him, but it doesn't matter, it's fine. We'll do that. You're out of the game. I don't know how much it did to you. Well, it did quite a bit of damage, actually, to you. So you're down to six. Not quite enough to kill, but we will finish you off here. Take that. Bye! Well, it's nice to finish you off with a crit. Three times as powerful as what actually needed to kill you. And more food. Loads of food. I actually could do with eating some of this food. Uh, 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 uh. Well, I mean... <laughs> Forget the busts. I'll take the cash. Yeah. Duh. All right. Who we got in here? Hopefully something slightly more challenging. I thought there was a fight in here. I'm sure there is. It's just that we're doing some weird scout out first. There must be a fight in here. No, I swear it. Look. It's got the little symbol for a fight. That's a bit bizarre. All right. I mean, I'll take it. Pack contains loot. Ah, uh, cool. Some more anti-venom. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. All right, we do have a trap here. I'm pretty sure you're going to be the man for the job. 70. I don't want to click on you twice. 50. 60. 70. Uh, 50, rather. It is. So, all right, Mallory. Come on. Not a good start, Mallory. I'm not going to lie. Raincourt was clicking, kicking their ass at those traps in the last dungeon, and you can't even handle that. And you're better at disarming them than he is. And this is an easier dungeon. Ooh. Okay. The Hulking Swinator. I do love the name Swinator. It does sound awesome. And large Corpse Eater. Oh, cool. We got to go first before Mallory, which is kind of handy. I'm not really sure who I want to attack here, though, to be honest. Um, I suppose... Hmm. I think they count as two, so I don't know if he's going to be able to hit behind. So probably best to attack this bad boy. Oh, critical as well. Very nice. I'll mark you, because I don't think Mallory will be able to hit him with the Collect Bounty behind. So... But yeah, yeah, I didn't think we could, so that would have been a waste. So yeah, we'll attack the large corpse eater first. 32. I think that was the max I could have done without getting a crit. So he's pretty much gone. Technical devour. Oh, really? And you're going to like leave me with a parting present of a critical like that? Oh, shit. He's in a little bit of trouble there. All right, thankfully, that wasn't too much damage. Uh, you might as well bleed and finish this prick off. If he bleeds, I think it's dead. It didn't get bled, which is rather annoying. Um, but I don't want him to attack again, so I think it is going to be a Grape Shot Blast. There we go. Kind of would have liked to have inflicted a bleed on him, but never mind. I really need to get a heal on here, though. Um, could we stun him? We've not got a great chance to stun him, it must be said. Would it be better just to hit him? I'm going to try and stun him. Let's see. Did stun him. Excellent. That's really handy. I have to risk it for a biscuit sometimes. Right, we need to heal instantly here. One! Oh, man! Well, at least you didn't bleed him. All right, wake up from your stun. That's fine. Now time to bleed you. 20! That was a good hit. And a bleed? Yeah, boy. All right, and uh, another hit. 18, pretty good as well. And a bleed? Yep, okay. So that's going to start stacking up. You can try and stun him again. I don't think that's going to work a third time. So we'll collect bounty. 
Yeah, not bad. 15s. Uh, we need to do that heal again. I really want to mark him, but like, I think we should kill him with the next round of attacks anyway, so we'll get a heal in. One again! Come on, what's your problem with um, Dunsk, man? You obviously don't like him. Um, we'll hit you there, 16s. And a bleed. So what are you down to? to oh, I was about to say, is that enough to kill you? And it was. So cool. Alright, you're just basically going to eat some food, because I've got so much food, it's unbelievable. Yeah, I've got like 20 food. So we'll just eat a bit to get you up off the bottom. Uh, unfortunately, we can't take all of that jazz. Is there anything else I'd like to throw away? Busts? Yeah, I mean, I, I don't mind keeping some, because I, I, I keep forgetting to have a look if I've actually built everything or not. Food stuff crate. Okay, so this is the first crate. Yeah? Uh, Alright, now we have to make a decision. Well, money's not really super important to me, so we'll swap it for there. I mean, a, a jade. I know we can stack them, but, you know, whatever. It doesn't matter. So that's the first one out the way. Oh, we'll head up north, because we will still sort of come round. Uh, we'll certainly use that straight away. So are they only going to be, because that's the always thing I always forget, are they only going to ever be in those rooms at the end? And I'm still not sure why that hasn't actually activated. Like, there was nothing in there for me to activate when there should have been. Don't know if that's a glitch. I suppose we'll catch it on the way back again. Wow, three pig hooks. I don't think I've ever fought three Captain Pig hooks by themselves. Um, that should be kind of fun. There we go, one down. Good start indeed. Let's try that healing shit again. Zewa! Three attempts to heal him. Done a maximum of two heals. At least we didn't get bled on any of them. But that's quite incredible. Really unlucky. Alright, Grape Shot Blast these pig peeps. Hmm. Kind of wish you'd killed one, but never mind. Uh, which one hasn't attacked? I'm pretty sure that one had attacked. So let's just wicked hack him. Pretty sure it was the front one. I might be wrong, though. I'm quite often, <laughs> I was going to say, I'm quite often wrong in those situations when I'm not sure. There you go. Alright. Um, you know what? Stun. Good. The reason why I wanted a stun is because I want to heal. Uh, it's almost in a situation. Alright, we'll heal you instead. Free. What's this pathetic healing, Bassett? And why the hell are there kids shouting outside my house? Sorry, I don't know if you can hear it, but... It's like a bunch of children just shouting really loudly. Might have to go out there like the cranky old man and be like, Hey, you kids, keep it down. Get off my lawn. Yeah, anyway. Um, Alright, so that heal wasn't it. What's your problem, man? Why are you healing so rubbish? Might as well finish you off. A bit disappointing. Oh, what's this little star? Ninja star. Dodge stone. Eh, it's only a common artifact. Uh, well, we'll take that. And we will bodge off everything else. <coughs> Pardon me. Head him back up top, 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 top. It's basically going to be pitch black pretty soon, isn't it? I think I'm going to use the uh, camp here. Yeah, I think I'm going to use the camp. I'm not going to bother put. Oh, is this more food? Pretty sure if we use medicinal herbs here. There we go. Make some bit of meat edible, so wow, that's a ton of food. But that's kind of handy because it basically just means we can heal up. Yeah, having medicinal herbs in the Warrens, you don't really need to take that much food. You should take some because you just never know. You might get unlucky and not get shit like stuff like this to help you out. You know, you might just not get them. You might randomly not encounter them. But on the whole, it's pretty good. Well, there we go. At least you're one for two of those traps, Mallory. That's a, that's a you know moving in the right direction. Alright, in, south, at least these corridors are new. Well, I suppose that middle room's new as well, we haven't been in it. The sack is empty. Never mind. Is there another trap? There is another trap. Come on, Mallory, go two for free. One for free. Disappointing. And, oh, and you bled as well? Alright, well, you can use one of those. Since you are trying, I suppose. You're not doing a good job, though. One a free trap springing when you're 70% uh, proficient at that. It's not really good. I'm beginning to question your 70% proficiency. Who's telling me that? Are you just making that up? So, yeah, 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 yeah. 70% of the time I disarm traps. It doesn't seem like that, my friend. It doesn't seem like that. We'll leave that well alone. What shall we get into a fight in this room now, this time around? Despite, oh, there's a fight here. So someone has decided to um, jump in. Let's see who it is. Oh, free, free of yous. 
interesting little combos of who we're going to be fighting. Right, I can't actually kill one of these outright, can I, without a crit? So you know what? I think I'd rather stun one. Let's stun you. Back one's probably going to be a bit trickier to hit, and he's come to the front. I should have done that the other way around. But never mind. Um, and let's weaken and curse another one, because we are going to heal up in this next room. So yeah, I don't think we quite need to do anything else. Yep, there we go. So you're going to be a bit debuffed if you do get to attack. Yep, that's you're going to do. You're going to miss. Oh, he did hit, but he did zero damage. But Oh, you wanker. What's this stomach cramp bullshit? That doesn't sound good. But I'd rather you just stress me out. Motherfucker, eh? All right, Grape Shot Blast. Bam. Kind of wasted the critical on that one. Would have been probably better if you'd critical one of the other two. Who had less health, but... Hey-ho, what can you do? All right, finish him. See you later. And can we get another go? Yeah, what's this stomach cramp, Juju? Uh, all right, not the end of the world. It's, it is annoying, but there's worse things that could have happened to you. Let's put it that way. Um, ooh. Ooh. Egg! Um, <laughs> do you have a lot of food? Do have a lot, of, lot of stuff. All right, I want the money. <laughs> Forget what I was saying about not wanting the money. I'm a liar. We'll take the cash there because that will stack up. I'll get more cash than what I will at those emeralds. I'm pretty sure. So we'll come out. But yeah, I still want the cash more than I want anything else. What's going on there? Oh yeah, because we've actually been down this corridor before. I, that was an invisible trap. I'm not having that one. That one wasn't your fault. You, you were just unlucky that it was you who got hit by it. I swear that wasn't there last time I came through, but we'll ignore it for now because we can make up some space. I swear it wasn't there when I went through there last time. Right? Might be wrong. I'm pretty sure I'm not. I'll have to watch the video back. It wouldn't be the first time that I missed something though like that, so... So it probably was there and I just didn't see it. Uh, 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 so you need basically the healing and the stressing. Has anyone got anything actually really good to reduce stress on one person? Not really. Okay, so... I'm basically all just going to have to give you a bit of encouragement, it seems. You don't have anything for yourself. No, you've just got kind of buffs for yourself. Which is kind of selfish, really, isn't it? don't have anything to... <laughs> you make yourself better, but you can't reduce your stress. Um, That's pretty much it. I think everyone's reduced your stress as best we can. Now it's time to try and heal you, I suppose. That was a pretty decent heal. Good. Uh, we've still got four. I do quite like the bandit scent, so less likely to be surprised until next camp. Yep. And what does that leave us with? Two. Could we heal him a little bit more? Might as well. Yeah. Okay, might as well. There you go. Take that as well. Fantastic. Rest up. Mm. We get ambushed. Oh, and this is quite a nasty ambush as well. This isn't fun. Especially with the surprise. The added surprise. Snake surprise. Um, Alright, what am I going to do to you? Do I want to stun you? I think I do want to stun you straight off the bat. So we'll do that. You fucking bit. Alright, okay. At least she got stunned. Yes, she resisted the move around. That's what it was. Um, meanwhile, vulnerability hex for sure on you. Get that out of the way so next time Mallory can give you some pounds. Alright, you've only got pistol shot. Probably a good idea to start attacking you, though. Oh, and a critical. Good. See you later, piggy drummer boy. Good times. Now we can concentrate on the slavering gore. Get some bleeds up. Oh, 37 and a bleed. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Ha ha, spirits claim you. Claim you, spirits. Uh, and now it's time for a weakening curse. Take some of that. Yeah. You're not very dodgy, damagey, or accurate. Then we'll hit you again. Oh! Did even get to hit him, Mallory? Good times. That was pretty. That, that was pretty easy in the end. This expedition at least promises success. Got a few bee slayers ring. I mean, we'll take both because we can. And then we'll open that. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, cool. When did we get that key? Can't remember getting it. Obviously, we must have got it. But I just don't remember. All right, okay. On to the next one. Trundle, 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 trundle. Oh shit, I oh, know, I did use my camp. I didn't use my camp, but yeah, I did. I think that's our last shovel as well. No, it's not. We've still got one more, so we're okay. 
All right, who's we fighting now? Uh, oh, actually, this is quite a nasty fight. <laughs> this isn't fun. This isn't fun at all. All right, vulnerability hex. Oh, and a critical on you. Good times. But you got to go before Mal uh, before Bassett, which is handy because Bassett's now going to hit the swan, the him, whatever his name is, hulking swine at all. That's it. Twenty-four. Kind of would have liked to crit, but never mind. You did your best. Uh, bleed. Bleed, bleed your swine at all. All right, cool. Are we all going to get to attack? No, all right. Ah, that's what happens. That's what happens when you try that cheap move. Ah, and as well for you as well. All these cheap moves can't do shit. 13, that's a little bit disappointing. I was kind of hoping for more, but we do have seven damage there coming in from the bleed. Not a big fan of that, but seven damage is what? Four times 20, yeah, four divided by 28. Is seven, so we could leave him in seven turns he died, but we don't have to bleed damage for that long, so forget what I'm saying. Oh, bye bye bye, hulking swine, it's all good. So now we've just got two fairly simple people, although it's still not nice. You know, I don't want him marking, I don't want him bleeding me, that's for sure. I think, in fact, of putting a curse on the swine reaver, I think I'm actually going to uh, give him a bit of a hex. I feel like that's the right move to make. And then we're going to hit him with a. Oh no, we can't hit him. Uh, we'll hit you. 15s, that's fine. That's fine. Alright, now we're going to do a Grape Shot Blast. You're dead because you're bled. Yep, bye bye, see you later. And that just leaves you, who's debuffed. Miss, miss. Oh, you hit with a crit as well, you motherfucker. And stun. That's a little bit of a bitch move there, fucking pig face. Alright, how about this for a bitch move? 12, but you're bleeding, right? Yeah, in your face. In your oinky face. And actually, I kind of want to heal again, so I think maybe we'll try and do a stun. Yeah, okay, that's good. Yep, take your damage. Is he dead neck? No, he's still got two to go. But he's come out of his stun. Why aren't you using Adrenaline Rush? There we go. Good job. Uh, let's try and stun you again. If we can stun you again, it would be nice. No, he resisted this time, which is a shame. I'm still going to use the heal, though. 17, there you go, he heals himself, heals himself more in one heal than he did pretty much like in seven attempts to heal other people, that's amazing. Um, Alright, okay, what has the actual best accuracy? Nine, is that 87? Just want to make sure to secure 87, alright, well it doesn't really matter, you do that one. Oh, and a crit as well, cool. Cool, 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 so no stress basically. I'll take what we can. I am's what I am's and I'll take what I can's. I don't need the Beast Slayer ring. Doo -doo. My Popeye inspiration. Um, yeah, because that's a thousand gold. That's worth more than the Beast Slayer ring, isn't it? Beast Slayer ring's like 750. Alright, I think that might be the last. What do we get from here again? Um, oh, yeah, bandages. Bandages. Alright, we'll use that. Why not? And what we get this time? Wow! Stuff cool stuff, eh? Now it must be carried home. Well, I think we're alright on the anti-venom. No one's really done shit to us. Uh, we'll take that for sure, and you just eat all the food. There we go. Coolio. Coolio Gangster's Paradise. Alright, come on, at least get to two out of four. At least hit 50% on these. There we go, at least we're at 50%. That's fine. I can live with 50%. I can't live with 50%, that's not good. You've got to be over 70%. Um, interesting. Interesting. How do we wish to play this? Well, let's curse you. Yeah, good. And then... Alright, can't quite hit you. We can stun you though. Or we could come hither you. Let's try and come hither you. Come, come, come. Come, my friend. Oh, you bastard. Oh, well, never mind. That was a bit of a waste. Probably should have just killed one of these. Probably would have been better. Uh, they don't bleed very well, do they? Well, they can be bled, but just not... That's not usual. Wicked hack. Better chance at a crit, is it? How much better chance is it? About 5% extra. Alright, well, I mean, we'll, we'll, uh, yeah, we'll do that. That's almost a guaranteed kill if I do it to him. I'll risk it for a biscuit. Yeah, there we go, it worked. Good times. Uh, now, Grape Shot Blast. Not quite killing anyone, but did do some damage. Two, I'm alright with that. I'm not alright with the Blight, just after I got rid of my fucking anti-venom, but, you know, that's always the way it works, isn't it? You get rid of something and then instantly you wish you had it. Go on, blight me again. No, at least he resisted. Alright. Wow, how many goes are these cunts getting? Easy now, pig face. Well, you're not really doing much to me, so I can kind of live with it. Um, I think... 
don't really need to do it. I think it's just best to... How much does that do? Right, yeah, whatever. Let's kill you. Get you out of the game. No reason not to. We couldn't really have killed anyone. We might have if we'd done maximum damage with a curse on him, but I think that was the better move. You should finish him. There we go. Actually, maybe I should have attacked him because he could blight some more of my people. But then again, he could raise my stress. My stress is quite low, though. Uh, all right. Take that and we're out of here. Seems like I should have taken a bit more damage than what I did. Wow, I'm getting tons of <laughs> tons of cash in this dungeon. It's unbelievable. Uh, we don't need that. Uh, nothing good ever comes from this, does it? Should put some holy water on it. All right, that did nothing. Never mind. I, I know this does bad, but I can't remember what it is. The hero is deeply disturbed. There we go. I should have known better. That was it. Yeah, I always fall for that one. I always think like, yeah, I can get away. But it doesn't matter. Whatever. It's fine. It's a little bit annoying you got that stress, but I'll live with it. Eat some food. Uh, cool, a torch. Kind of, I'm glad I've run into a torch. I kind of want to use it. In fact, I'm going to use a couple more. We'll take it since we have a free spot, but we'll probably be getting rid of it fairly soon. Shit, we've only got two more rooms to go in. This fucking final grain sack better be in one of them. Uh, Alright, what's this? Daddy, baby, pig. Or mummy, baby, pig, maybe. I don't know. Uh, right, well, one thing I do know is Mark. How many eyes do you have? A lot. A lot of eyes. Oh, I thought he was blinking when I was covering over him, but it's just coincidental. Uh, okay, collect bounty. 28. Uh, it's okay. It's okay. You should be able to finish this shit bag off. I think I'd actually rather wicked hack it. I think I am. Oh, ho, ho. just for the more chance of a critical, since it was a slim chance of bleeding. Roar! That's it. Roar like a, like a beast. Beastly roar. And then we'll do one of these. How you like it? How's my ass taste? Not as good. Vomit. Miss. Piss me. I only just realised that face on his chest. I've never noticed that before. Don't know how I've missed that, but there you go. Uh, all right, you should be attacking next. So let's kill you. Bye. And that leaves him. He must have really strong arms to be able to do that. Like, he doesn't even rest himself. Like, most people would then sit if they weren't moving, but he's just, like, doing push ups constantly. 24 7 push ups. Take that, pig face. Cool. Uh, stuff. Stuff and things. Uh, you can eat some of that food. Uh, as for the rest of this stuff, can't take it, unfortunately. Bye. Uh, we do have that key though, so we will use it on the heirloom chest. What does that unlock for us? Ooh, wow, again, so much gold. I don't think we can. Oh no, we can stack them more over there, can't we? Come here. And since we have a free space, we will put that there, but how much longer the citrines will last there, I don't know. Right, please, Grain Sack, be in this last room because I'm going to be a bit annoyed if it's not. Because that means I've missed it somewhere. In radiance, may we find victory. No, I don't really care for missing things. That was an invisible trap. And what bogs me as well is that how high the light was. Alright, just the way is lit. throw away those torches. I don't need them anymore. It's the last room. Actually, I might need them if I need to backtrack. Why'd I do that? Ah, oh, no, there it is. That's alright. And a bunch of spitters. Okay. Okay. Okay, lads. This is how we're going to do it. Take that. Good, because you're what I worry about more. And you were the first to attack as well. Ah, good thing I cursed you, eh? Man, you missed. Um, it's a shame we can't attack the back one, so I guess it probably makes sense just to finish off uh, one of these. There we go, take that. Wonderful. There we go, lower your stress as well a bit. Um, you, yeah, I mean, if you hit, you should kill, although your accuracy is not great. What about if you use finish him on him? Again, if you hit, you should kill. So we'll try that. You missed. Uh, the accuracy wasn't great on either of them, but I suppose I had to take it. Oh, wow. Come on. Come on. Come on now. All right. Well, at least they're missing back. But come on. You're taking the piss here a bit. Two. I can live with that, even though he is marked. All right. Let's show the world how it's really done. We'll do another little um, hex on you. Yeah. Good, good, good. So both the spitters are in a little bit of bother. Now let's try and kill this one. He usually attacks first. There we go. We got him out of the way, which is wonderful. Can we get another attack in before he goes? We can. Do I want to... Hmm. Now here's the question. Do I want a Grape Shot Blast? I would rather just kill that Spitter. Straight out. That might be the better move. 
It's not really as... I mean, the Grape Shot Blast is just as accurate. Yeah, well, let's just go with it. There we go. We killed him anyway. I was just a bit worried because there was a chance we might not have killed it. Fairly tough to hit these little bastards. Well, not that tough, but, I mean, it's easy for us to miss them. Wow, tons more gold again. How much gold am I going to be coming out of here with? This is ridiculous. Um, you know what? I don't need the shovel anymore. Uh, but it's point... Well, no, I can throw away the food as well, so we might as well take those. can throw that away. Don't need that. Uh, we can eat some of this food. Why not? Just not want to be wasteful, you know. As they say, people are starving in some parts of the world, so I want to be seen as an arsehole for own food away. And we'll take the last crate. Cool. I just want to do this, though. I just want to move this around. There we go. So that's all in order. We actually ended up with a free spot, so we were a bit wasteful. But that's going to be it. Let's head out. No one's going to get promoted to level 5 on this mission because I checked their, how much points they needed beforehand and they weren't quite there yet, but not far. That's a lot of money. That's what, 21,000, 21,500 almost, like from a normal level, like not a boss level or something like that. That's a ton of, ton of gold. Ton, ton, ton. I've got so many of these sacrificial cauldrons I've got to sell. I think that's like my fourth or fifth one. I've got to start selling. I don't even use them. Yeah, I just don't even use them, so I think I'm going to sell those. Oh, nearly. You've got to be right on the grid. Well, okay, so the next level you go on, you become level four, so that's pretty good. Uh, you will get leveled up on the next one as well, so that's good, as will you. So the only person we'd be waiting on is Bassett, who needs a couple more. But not far away, that's fine. Dunsk, Night Owl. Yeah, well... Okay, I mean, it's not a negative. That's the good thing about it. Dark Temptation, prone to... Yeah, we're getting rid of that straight away for you, Mallory. Getting rid of that as soon as we walk back into town. Don't like that. Come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go over to the sanitarium. Come on, into this room, my friend. Don't worry, nothing bad's going to happen to you. I mean, he's got those smelly stomach cramps as well, but the Dark Temptation's a bit more annoying, so we'll get rid of that. It'd be good if you could get rid of two things at once. Unfortunately, you can't. Uh, actually, there's some interesting stuff here. We're already maxed out up here as well. Uh, stress while camping, heal skill. I do like that more heal skill. I think I've already got one of these, but I'll buy another one. I've got so much money, it's unbelievable. Tough ring. Mm. Uh, I don't know about that. Martyr seal. I never really used that. I might sell it. Um... <laughs> Kind of situational. Torch needs to be very low. Legendary Bracer. Yeah, I'll take another one of those. Nothing wrong with that. Sacred Scroll. Didn't I just buy one of these? That's what I did. Oh, another Focus Ring. I don't really need a third one. I'm going to get one when I fight the um, the Prophet anyway, so I don't think I need to buy another one. Uh, Alright, I'm, I'm alright with all that. Alright, let's come out as well. That's all upgraded... I don't care about that. Is the tavern fully upgraded? No. Oh, wow. Okay. The brothel's barely been touched. All manner of well, it's, it's upgraded now. Uh, not that we ever need to go to the survivalist camp. but no, not, not that we wouldn't go there. What I mean is, is like we're pretty much leveled up on everyone who we can. Stagecoach? Yeah, might as well level you up to the tops as well. What's his name? Papon? That's a pretty awesome name. Um... I'm not really sure if there's anything else that needs upgrading. Yeah, I literally that's it now. Yeah, all right. Everything has been upgraded. Cool. Uh, you know what as well? Just one other thing, since you're not going to be coming. Is there anything lazy eye? Again, you don't have any ranged attacks, so it's not that big a deal. I'm going to waste time on it. Belcott. Um, okay, we can get rid of... Paranormania. Yeah, alright, we'll do that since you're not going to be going on the next mission. Paranormania, there we go. Uh, who else? Mallory, we're getting rid of something for you already. Bassett. Bad Gambler. Shocker. Intense craving for alcohol. Um, <laughs> why no? That's basically what he is. Alright, we'll put you in here and I'll get rid of that Shocker, so minus 10 stun resist, why not? Uh, cool. Why has that one been shut? Did someone just die? Who did I put in there again? Didn't I put Belcott in there? I thought I did. A bit bizarre. I could have sworn I put her in there, but never mind. Uh, it's fine. Right, we're going to end things there uh, on that note of notiness. Um, so, right, basically, this is just, you know, trying to train people up. We've got three people in that group. 
who are going to go up a level, although unfortunately Belcott's only actually going to go up to level four. But we don't really need Belcott. We only took Belcott because Hughes wouldn't lower herself to go on that mission. And she's obviously part of the level five crew who will be taking on, um, you know, the, 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 the big boss bad guys in like the Weld and the Warrens and all that. So that's good. Um, next time, I think that's more what we're going to concentrate on. Next time we are going after the, um, the smelly gibbering prophet, who I expect to beat as easily and as badly as anything I've ever beaten before in my life. Big words, big words, but I feel confident about that. Anyway, but until next time, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.